Christian Petrarca, he's entertaining, he'll play with the kids, he'll keep him entertained. Probably McGovern. Um, yeah, he can bring the food. Sean Burgoyne, nothing to do with me and Sean, more to do with Amy and Karen being pretty good friends. Steph Martin's at, at Brisbane, he's a very intellectual sort of a man and you can have many interesting conversations with him, so I'd have him over. Ah, uh, the captain. Joe Watson at the moment. You know, the one you want to re-sign and keep going for next year. Harley Balich. Probably Big Dawson Simpson, he was over the other day, he helped fix up my little pool shed, so... Um... Whoever's played best for that particular week, I put on a massive big roast for them and uh, lay it all on the line. Oh, I like Lacroix's humour. Probably Isaac Smith. Uh, he's a different cat, but he's a ripper. Definitely uh, Daisy Thomas, he's got some real quick wit. Probably Louis Taylor, he's a bit of a jack-in-the-box. Oh, Andrew Mackey for me, but... Maybe um, he's a little bit older, so um, I can understand his humour a little bit better than I can the 19-year-olds. I probably tend to think Connor Menninger is the funniest player at our club. Cole Cheney has a, have a good laugh with Cole from time to time. Uh, Roy Laird makes me laugh, just some of the things he does. Gussie Monfries creates a bit of spirit around our football club. The boys always get a good laugh out of Magic Door. Tommy Sheridan. Oh, probably Daniel Hanbury. Probably he's sure. James Kelly has, can throw out a gag. They're all pretty boring, I think. Oh, there's plenty of them. <laughs> there's a movie called A Race Ahead, which was a shocker. My w wife took me to this film called Tree of Life that Brad, Lo Brad Pitt was in. Thought it was, she told it was going to be the greatest film ever, worst film I've ever seen, went to sleep. Money Monster. My wife's dragged me to some pretty bad ones. Horrendous film. <laughs> I'm not a horror movie man, so Friday the 13th. Oh, Godzilla by a long way. The Attack of the Killer Tomatoes, and that's a very long time ago, so the young viewers of this wouldn't have even heard about it, but... Uh, that's probably rated a, probably a half out of ten, I reckon. Fury Road, uh, the, the new Mad Max movie. Mickey Blue Eyes is probably one. Probably no one's ever seen it. <laughs> oh, I'm not a fan of Harry Potter. It, um, it just doesn't make sense to me. Billy Joel at Madison Square Garden, that was a uh, bit of a highlight. ACDC. The Dave Matthews Band. Cold Chisel. Oh, I have to be the Rolling Stones in the MCG. Nothing better than watching Mick Jagger in full flight. The Guns N' Roses in 1994. A big Midnight Oil fan back in my youth. I saw Counting Crows at Hamer Hall, that was pretty good. Yeah, I did like a David Bowie concert that I went to a long time ago in the 80s. Probably a Michael Jackson concert I went to years ago. Probably Dire Straits up in Darwin as a young fella. I've been to five of them in Springsteen, hands down. Really good steak. Steak. Thai. I love Chinese food. I'm a big fan of seafood. Uh, both catching it and cooking it and eating it. Your pizza. Uh, I love Indian food. You should probably expect that. I aren't too patient with the fishing. <laughs> a very simple one, meat and three veg. I like a home cooked roast. Anything roast. Roast pork, roast chicken, roast lamb, roast beef. Oh, fish and chips. Peking duck and lobster. My wife makes up lovely curried sausages. Whatever my missus cooks, very good cook. Whatever my wife's cooking at the time, I'll eat anything. Dealing with everything that's not about footy. The press. It's juggling your time. Probably the scrutiny and the demand. If you drop your guard, then someone will pick up on it. Time allocation. Things like telling players that they're being dropped from the t team or that they're no longer on the list. When you have to sack players. Failure can't cope with perseverance. It's never as good as or bad as it seems. Probably the one I use a fair bit. Things are never as bad as they seem and never as good as they seem. Do not follow where the path may lead. Create your own path and leave a trail. Get comfortable being uncomfortable. It's a coach's responsibility to work for the players, not the other way around. If it's worth doing, it's worth doing properly. The best predictor of tomorrow is success today. Who dares wins? I have tended to say you get where you deserve a bit. It is what it is. Put the overalls on, boys, and get to work. Uh, probably my family. My family? Family? I'd better say the family. Good food. Am I supposed to say my wife and my little girl? Exercise. Coffee. Coke. Chinese food. <laughs> and beer. The three Fs. Uh, family, friends and footy. Um, always go in that order. These days I, I can't live without my kids. Probably my children. I'd love to say my family and friends, but probably my phone. Family. Be the easy one. Love spending time with the boys. And my wife, of course. <laughs> uh, 
I can't get bothered with my car keys.